This is Dave Espino and welcome back to The Daily Hustle. Today I got a really cool story to tell you. It's about a bizarre find that I made just the other day. Now we've moved out of state. We moved from Southern California to Idaho. And the other day my son wanted to drop by a used electronics store. This is basically for electronics gearheads, people who are into electronic stuff and you know they want to buy different parts and used parts and things like that. Well, my son's really into this vintage electronic stuff. He, he just seems to think that way. And so we dropped by this store that I was expecting would just have nothing but electronics gear, right? Which is what it's all about. And the minute I opened the door, I saw four of these skateboard wheels. Now, not just any skateboard wheels, but these are Kryptonics green skateboard wheels that were made around 1977-ish somewhere around that time. And I knew them by sight because I actually owned some of these on my original vintage deck way back in the day. And so I immediately grabbed them and I looked at the price and I said, sold, because let me show you the price on this wheel. See if you can see that, $2.94, okay. The weird thing about this is, this is sitting in an electronics store in Idaho where, you know, there's, I'm, I'm assuming there weren't a whole lot of skateboarders back in 1977. Now there are, right? Because skateboarding has exploded. But back then there were very few skaters in anywhere other than California, Florida, Texas, etc. So to find these in the middle of Idaho in an electronics store was just so bizarre. I posted these on a Facebook group for skaters over 50. And believe it or not, uh, it got over 480 likes, the post, showing these wheels and showing what an incredible deal I got. Because if I were to sell these right now on eBay, uh, the, this set of four wheels would sell for about 125 to 150 bucks. Okay, and I paid $12 for the whole set of four wheels. But the cool thing about it is I just wanted to share with you, uh, sometimes you'll find things in the most amazing places. Sometimes you'll find things where you least expect them. But man, the minute I opened that door and I saw those wheels, I made a mad rush for them. I grabbed them and I held on to them. In fact, I looked over at the guy at the counter and he was looking at me like, wow, he just went right for those wheels. It was so weird. Um, and then I asked him, you know, what, are, what what's the story on these wheels? Why are they here? And he says, well, uh, mainly for the bearings. So the bearings inside the wheels, apparently, you know, a lot are used in electronic motors and things like that. So apparently because of the bearings, the wheels were in an electronic shop. <laughs> so that's my story of the $12 set of wheels that I could sell for 125 bucks, but you know what? I'm gonna hang on to them. These are a keepsake. These are from my memories. I used to have an Alva skateboard with these wheels on it. And these things were iconic. Back at that point in time, everybody had these wheels on their board because this was the wheel that everyone was using. All the pros were using this wheel. So it's very iconic. So that's why I'm gonna just hang on to it. But I wanted to share that story with you. Uh, the main lesson I think here is always be on the lookout, always be ready to find stuff no matter where you are and no matter how unusual it might seem, you might find stuff there. So be on the lookout. Hope you enjoyed this message. I'll see you tomorrow on The Daily Hustle.